This is Everon, a large-scale map being overrun by the Russians during the Cold War. You are this guy a remnant of the rebel faction trying to take back his land using guerrilla tactics. And this scenario is part of the single player game mode added recently into Armory Forger, Combat Ops Everon, or Resistance Ops was how it was marketed. Now this can also be a co-op experience, but for gamers who have no friends except for online ones that play different games, sometimes you're looking to just have some fun by yourself. But that's why this game mode is here. Here is how this works. You've got your safe house that you start at here. This is where you spawn in, you'll have a room full of guns, and then there are several other safe houses with a couple weapons and vehicles scattered around the map indicated by these little orange arrows. These can be taken out by enemy forces occasionally, so not all of them will be available to you. You're also going to have several main objectives scattered across the map, and this is how you win the game mode. You complete these various missions, and then you get to extract from the island. But don't be fooled, this isn't going to be easy. The AI are the least of your worries. Where are you at? Holy smokes. Oh, okay, well, maybe the AI are all of your worries and they are absolutely cracked. Whoa! Okay, the AI don't mess around in this apparently. <laughs> Which makes doing this solo incredibly difficult, but we're gonna do it anyway. There are a couple other things along the way to help us out and some mechanics that give you a little bit of an edge against the enemies. You'll see those here. But for now, we're gonna hop in and begin our journey at the safe house. We've got four different missions that we could carry out. We've got an intel mission where we have to find intel marked on the map with these little red crosshairs, I guess you could call them. And then we've gotta place it in the Dropbox location. We've got a deliver vehicle task where we have to find a specific vehicle on the map and drive it there. We've got an attack task where we have to basically just demoralize the enemy by taking out large numbers of troops and then retreating. And then we've got the eliminate task where we have to take out a high value target. But for this one, we're going to start out with the, um, <laughs> the easy method, I guess, if you want to call it that. In today's episode, we're going to be completing the intel assignment where we find some intel by assaulting a camp and then drop it off at the marked location. I decided I wanted to use a couple immersive mods too along the way. I will point those out when you see them. But for now, we're going to take our civilian car for a nice, easy drive toward the westward location to find that intel. Just a civilian in a civilian car, nothing to worry about, right? Okay. So they know that I'm not friendly. All right. Uh-oh. 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 Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh. You know, I expected that to go a little better. <laughs> Homies are nuts. Okay, we're on the right road here. If my calculations are correct, we are right here. We're going to follow this closer to Lemuel and head a little bit south from Lemuel. Well, that doesn't sound good. Is that my stuff? I, I think I have like a, a hideout that way. What is that? Uh, All sign graphic has eliminated enemies in a firefight, but cannot carry away more supplies. Oh boy. Um, I feel like we had no choice here. This is crazy, man. I did not expect this war zone. Is that a BTR? I'm gonna have to pull off right. We need to we need to get out of here. We need to reorient. This is not good. I 
I feel like Harry Potter. Get out. Just get out. There we go. Oh, oh boy. We just had to flee that, man. Heckin' wild. We gotta figure out where we are now. Best way is probably to find the mule. We, I mean, we really got off the path. If we can find another vehicle, that would be superb. I don't know how easy that's going to be, though. What is that up there? Do I have binoculars? I don't, but I do have a sniper rifle. So let's see what that is. Something... something that's something okay it's a farm and this is that main road i think so the mule is probably right on the other side of that let's check here let's get up to this house make sure there's no resistance i just i do not want to be do not want to be on the middle of nowhere like this these ai are absolutely deadly By far the hardest thing about this game is not just not just not getting killed by the AI, but understanding directions, land nav, stuff like that, because I do not like I think that that right there is Lemuel. But I am not for certain. I thought it was that way. But I think it's that way now. I do like how it has that zoom in, though. That's really nice. It's a really nice addition. Very helpful. Okay, that's probably going to say Lemuel, right? Let's check. Let's calm down a little bit. Villa Nueve? What? <laughs> right here. Actually, that's good. We just have to head southwest a little. <laughs> it's good to see, but... I didn't know where the heck I was going. Probably about 170 from my position. We can find a road. We can find the possible intel. If it's not there, now I don't know if it's going to be there or not. I hope so. The last time I tried a spot where there was intel, there was intel. But this road, this looks like roadie. There we go. Okay. In that case, there should be we stay on this road on this little tiny path there should be possible intel location right on the left side there because we're headed north right sort of north that's that's north where are we headed oh okay there's two of them Three of them. Oh my gosh. I should I should let you know I have a mod on that changes the gun sounds. Holy smokes does that change that. I haven't shot this one yet. Oh golly, I like that so much better. Ooh, but that is loud. Holy smokes. Jeez. I, I got to say, I was not prepared for how loud that was going to be. Okay, the intel's probably up here. All right. I, d I thought I heard one more. Jeez, man. Nearly blew my eardrums out. Alright, I can put on his armor, put on his chest rig. Let's um, put on his helmet. As much as I like tiki, Peaky Blinders, Tiki Blinders, Peaky Blinders. Oh, oh! Oh my holy smokes, man. 
That is so loud. Maybe I shouldn't have put that mod on. Come on. Um, this isn't good. Be yep, because that's why. I need to get back. I need to get back down. Oh, this is terrifying. Oh, that is, that is absolutely terrifying. Gonna reload. There's one. I saw you. Come back. Got him. Really suppressed him. The these these sounds uh, are kind of wild. I can't I can't see him at all. I'm gonna need to move. I thought I had a grenade. Oh wow! Oh screaming. Move down. Move down. I'm toast. I'm absolutely toast. Uh, wh what's going on? Heavy bleeding. Light bleeding. Light bleeding. Minor injury. Somehow I had an explosion go off right next to me and s <laughs> somehow just some, just some light bleeding, huh? Come on. Come on. We need to keep going. It's getting lighter out. That arm closer to death. Listen, get back here. Okay, guerrilla tactics. I need to. What I need to push down again. Call sign. Oh man, we're getting toasted, man. They do not want us to fight. This is so much fun, though. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta flank out. Hide that. I gotta flank to the, to the left here. There just ain't no way. Really gotta focus on guerrilla tactics when you're the gorilla, you know? Shoot a little, move. Shoot a little, move. I was not expecting that many people, but. I suppose I should have. Make sure they're not flanking. Whew. Those sounds really, um, they really get to you. <laughs> oh my gosh. The sound mod. I, I, I feel like this game could be cool with like a, I tried to download a suppressor mod for this. Maybe I could just James Bond it, but that is not happening. Goodbye. Oh, I'm tired. There you are. Me and you, buddy. Don't turn your back on me. I have a different recoil system. I have a recoil mod on, which is what made that so heavy. That's terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. I if 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 I weren't wearing ear protection, which I, I'm assuming these guys aren't, uh, I wouldn't be able to hear. Like that would ruin engagements. I don't know if you ever shot a gun and heard it like that, but listen. We're gonna use this. I don't care if we leave some mags behind. This is how we're gonna have the most ammo. More guerrilla tactics. There's more than just that guy for sure. If I can get into this. You know what? I'm gonna get right here.
guy coming this way has no idea how I'm here. I expected him to keep going. <laughs> he told me. Daggone it. Thought I was sneaky. We could have chosen a better spot. I'm about to get executed, aren't I? Nope, just lose my blood. Okay, so obviously we didn't make it. Things didn't work out the way we wanted it to, but we can always come back. So what you do is you spawn back at the safe house, but I don't want to have to keep doing that. So instead, I grab a little something that we can set up that gives you a portable spawn point. But first, we have to get back there. And this time, we're not going to mess around. We're just going to go straight through Lemuel. I'm going to assume they're going to shoot at me at Lemuel too. I bet every town is fortified in some way. We will find out in one mile. Just fly through it, Tacky. Fly through it. Don't let them stop you. Look at that. Look at that. See ya, suckers. Yep, we're gonna hop out. Woo! Little Dukes of Hazards. Wait. Is this right where I was already? Okay, actually, we are very close. Um, here, oh, there it is. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set my tent down here because what I can do is I can, I can set a tent and then I can attack. So I'm going to set a tent a bit closer. Right underneath here looks like a good spawn point, right? Yeah, like right here. Beautiful view, too. Beautiful view. Wait. Did I grab it? Did I grab the tent? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Boom. Respawn point. Perfect. I don't know. <laughs> do not know if I'll have ammo when I respawn there, but that's beside the point. Let's do this. So in short, I die again, but luckily I can spawn in at the tent and then I head over to one of the closest safe houses to stock up a little bit. I head back to the camp, I die, and I spawn at the camp with nothing, but something that I remembered is that if you stay really, really low to the ground, the AI have a harder time seeing you. So now is the time to grab what I need and skadoodle. Okay, coming up to try again. I feel like, uh, so right now I just have a macaron. Tiny little mac, okay. I feel like there should be bodies somewhere around here that I can loot, right? There's one right there. And it's not me. So if I can move up without being seen, without seeing anybody, I can grab some ammunition, I can grab a different weapon, and go guns a-blazing. We're about to win bigly. Now, if you're prone, it's harder for the AI to see you, so I've got a little bit more time to react in the event that they do so. Let's 
So far, so good. So far, so good. Sir? We are set. It's very embarrassing. I'm, I'm really sorry. Maybe this is the key. What do you think? A little snake in the grass? Don't have a very good escape, but I'm at least going to make it up there, it looks like. Okay, let's pause here. Do a little scouting action. Looks clear. I can check the tent. I'll actually have my body in there. One of them. Anyway. I really like this guerrilla war fighting thing. I mean, I just really like that it's, it's very dynamic. It changes uh, with each time that you play it. Don't shoot if we don't have to. Anybody up there? Let me go in here first. Hey, buddy. Good to see you. I saw you. Let's do this. Where are you? I expected a little bit more music. I think he's down. Okay, that was supposed to be a funny joke, but it turns out it just sucks. Did I get him? I did. Did not get that guy. Oh my heavens gracious. One over here. Okay, so now we just gotta somehow survive this. I'm gonna say, not at all likely. He's down. Well, he's down now. <laughs> I just gotta be careful of my angles here. And I do not see... So I don't see the little red folder that is what the... Uh, oh, I've got an arsenal here. Little red folder is the intel... Oh! Lay down. I need to heal. We're not going to take any chances. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Just a little, little spin. Forgot he does that. I forgot you don't lean when you're on the ground. Okay, good. That guy got revived. You just hear him get up. That's fantastic. Good teamwork. Okay, Goober. Come on. Keep it coming. I can do this all day. If this is what I need to do. This is what I'll do. I bet that was the one shooting at me, too. Just to be sure. Come on. 
Come on. Um. What is... Okay. That's kind of terrifying. Did not know Arma was a horror game. This is just me waiting at this point. Gotta reload. There's still one out there. Think, right? Is that it? That is terrifying, man. Those sounds are fantastic. Oh, he must be at an MG nest there. Oh. In. Cover. It is not here. Push into that tent next. Check, check. Push. We go cover to cover. I may have just cleared everything out, though. Come on. Nothing. What's in the arsenal here? Oh. Okay, nothing there. We're still going to need some ammunition. We have some vehicles now, at least. Several vehicles. There it is. Got it. anyway. What I need is more magazines. Gonna have to get it off gamers, aren't I? Dead gamers. Come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Am I gonna make this out alive? Not likely. We'll go to the coast. Make our way from there. Whew. Let's get to the road. Okay. Where, where can we go? Uh, south of the coast. This is where we just got our intel. We gotta go on that side of the... We also have to go west. East. We have to go the other way. Sorry. Nav is hard. Pass the mule. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Is there a... Is there a... 
Okay, there's a southern road we can take. We're gonna head down there. We're, we are not chancing it through the mule. Not with my luck. Oh. Ouch. If this thing blows up, I'm gonna... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Light bleeding. Hang on. Oh. <laughs> Looks like we're legging it. <laughs> Dang, freaking got it. I got 11 mags, though. Imagine how heavy that is. I got it. It only took two hours by myself. An hour of that was walking. <laughs> but it was fun. It's cool. I feel like we could we could do the whole island at some point. That'd be that's a really cool way to like do missions. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like. If you didn't, give it a dislike, subscribe for more, and until the next one, be bold, be courageous. Stay gray.